I do. Okay. I do. Uh, I, and look, it's his decision. And, and those aren't easy decisions. And, and he'll lean on his family. Um, you know, we have an outside source that we bring in that evaluates all of our players, that he's got a chance to listen to, to all that information. But Kyle will make the right decision and, and what's, what's right for him. Um, and look, we're assuming that everything goes great with his knee, right? I mean, so let's make that assumption. And, and then if that's the case, he'll have all the information in front of him and we're going to support him hundred percent, whatever it is. Um, and, and again, that's the nature of where we are today in college football. Guys got to make those kinds of decisions, but we'll support him. He's been a great teammate. Settling on a defensive structure. So it's keeping the points down, you know, Marshall, they gave up over 40 points and now the points are coming down and uh, teams have to spend a lot of their time or capital, if you will, on the field to score points. And so it's shortening the game, right? They're possessing the football. They're getting first downs. You know, they're, they're using up all their fourth downs. They're using all four and the game closes on you. And by the time you look up, it's, you know, four minutes to go in the half and you've had three or four possessions. So it's the way they're playing. Um, but I think it has started with um, the, the defense in particular, um, keeping the points down. Yeah. You know, you got to pick your spots. You got, as I said, I think I was answering the question earlier is that, uh, you know, the efficiency and effectiveness of your offense comes from players making plays and coaches making good calls. I mean, this, this is, this is a game that puts a lot of pressure on your play caller, you know, where, you know, you, you got to pick your spots because you do have to push the ball vertically. you got to get it down the field. You can't, you can't, they would love for you to check it down to the back every down come up and make that tackle because it's going to take you a long time and you may not get it in the end zone. And then they're really good in the red zone. They have a good scheme. They do a lot of really good things down in the red zone and make it difficult for you to score touchdowns. They're going to, I mean, there's going to be a double pass and there's going to be something that we haven't seen before a formation, you know, and we keep the book on them. I mean, and I mean, when I say the book, I mean, we've got everything from 2000, you know, and 11, you know, 10, when we, played him at first so we try to research all this stuff and then there'll be always something different what if he didn't play navy yes it would have been a question but because he played and prepared against navy it wasn't a question but if i hadn't had film and watched the structure of the defense and how they performed against um, navy it would certainly be a question